What is going on guys? Grave here today. Let's talk about the new event, the Zeal of Zenithar in-game event, which will be starting on June the 30th at 10 a.m. Eastern and running until July the 12th at 10 a.m. Eastern. I'm going to link all this information about the event down in the description below if you would like to read over it for yourself. But all you have to do to uh, kind of participate in the event is go to the festival grounds in Craglorn and pick up the unrefusable offer or get the free quest starter from the crown store. Once you finish the intro quest, you can pick up the daily quest called Honest Toil. Now what this is going to do is kind of give you some bonus boxes depending on what you know kind of activities you complete kind of like any of the other you know events we've had in the game. Each time you complete a daily quest, you'll receive a sublime parcel box. Uh, in addition, you can also net delightful parcel boxes by participating in the following activities. Completing the introductory quest, completing any master writ, your first daily crafting writ per account completed each day, defeating a world boss while grouped with a player in at least one of your player guilds, completing a world event while grouped with at least one player in one of your player guilds, or conquering each round of a group based arena challenge while grouped with a player who is in at least one of your player guilds has a chance of dropping the box. Now, if you complete all of the rounds in any of the arena kind of, you know, events or arenas that we can do, the final round uh, reward chest will contain a guaranteed parcel. It says, alternately, if you're not interested in hard work, there's a small chance to steal parcels from hardworking citizens through pickpocketing, strong boxes, or thieves' troves. Within the parcel boxes, there's a chance to require some different rewards. Of course, a tradable outfit style called the High Rock Spell Sword Armor. Crafting materials, provisioning ingredients, alchemy materials or ingredients, runestones, or motif style items, uh, crafting boosters, a small chance of gold tier booster or research time scrolls, furnishing or provisioning recipes, repair kits, siege repair kits, or a small chance of group repair kits. Also treasure maps, survey reports, imperial city vault keys, companion gear, or a random currency pouch. The random currency pouch could contain gold, tevlar, and there's an extremely small chance that the jackpot amount that gives you a hundred thousand of the associated currency. So there is a very small chance you could get a hundred thousand gold or tevlar from these currency pouches. The earnings from these pouch, jackpot, or otherwise are unaffected by any form of currency boosts. Also it talks about um, both boxes offer an opportunity to pick up these rewards, but the Sublime Parcel Box provides the best chance to obtain the most valuable rewards. It says, these event rewards aren't the only thing eligible during the Zeal of Zenithar event. Throughout the span of the event, everybody will benefit from these modifiers. Waste Rhine travel costs are reduced by 75%. Repair costs on, uh, at vendors are reduced by 50%. Crafting inspiration gain from all sources is increased by 100%, and vendor prices across Tamriel are reduced by 10%. These include vendors that sell items for gold, AP, or Tevlar, uh, Tevlar stones, including the gold vendor, or houses that are purchasable for gold. New rare social and combat wilderness encounters are prepared uh, are kind of throughout Tamriel for you to find related to the Zeal of Zenithar, and also we will have event tickets during this. Uh, during this, each time you complete the Honest Toil Daily Quest, in total you can collect 20, uh, 39 tickets Excuse me, by the end of the event. Just remember, you only can hold 12 at a time. So we will have the uh, event vendor here as well. And once you've earned a hefty number of tickets, head over to the uh, event merchant and exchange them for all three of the Soulfire Dragon Illusion Pet Fragments. All three fragments for the, of course, uh, mount and the bound style pages for the high rock spell sword armor style group repair kits and a new companion uh, guild commendations so this is kind of a interesting event it's something that it's almost like for crafters or, or you know for vendors and things like that it's something a little bit different than some of the other events we've seen in the past i kind of like the way um you know that they have handled it this time of course you know, like i said we'll have all the things within the event and of course the uh, tickets as well so you can complete morphing the uh, mount so if you're looking forward to getting that mount that can get done with this event as well uh, also the uh, event vendors will be selling 
some new items to help improve your companion skill line called the Companion Guild Commendations, which each of these three major guilds in ESO include the Fighters Guild, Mages Guild, and Undaunted. If you have a commendation associated with their organization, upon using the commendation on an active companion, they immediately reach the next skill rank for that specific guild. So this is going to be something that is going to be unique compared to what we have seen in the past when it comes to events, but I think a lot of people are really going to enjoy this. And finally, uh, the, of course, event vendor will be joined in the Belcraft Festival, uh, Festival grounds, excuse me, by a new colleague during the Zeal of Zenithar event and all upcoming events. The special merchant will offer a selection of Indrix from previous year's events uh, with a cycling inventory as the season changes. So a lot of us have, uh, or a lot of people in the community at least, have been asking for, you know, some of these uh, Indrix mounts to return now that the event vendor, you know, we're on to different things over the last couple years. Now you'll have the chance to actually go back and get those Indrix mounts if you didn't get them at the time or if you're new to the game and you never had a chance to get them at all. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this new event. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.